All right, so June is Men's Health Month, and we want to just give you some advice uh, if you're looking to get a new workout routine going. So this is Nick Fai, a personal trainer at Lifetime Des Moines, joining us this morning. And Nick, let's start with some data here. Why is this month uh, focused on men? Yep, so June's a really important month because it's really, really busy for a lot of individuals. Yeah. And so if you can do well this month, you're going to be able to master a lot of other months as well too. Uh, and especially for men where, you know, one of the leading killers for men is cardiovascular disease and diabetes. And, you know, being able to integrate new things into your workout routine, yeah. strength, cardiovascular exercise, or just simple recreational play since it's so nice here in Iowa, you know, this time of year where we can integrate that. And if you can get good yeah. this month, you're going to see a lot of results moving forward. Do you work with a variety of, of people who may be new to uh, getting a gym routine all the way to people who may be a little bit more advanced? Yep. So my exact job actually over at Lifetime is when you start at the gym, we meet to talk yeah. about where you're at, what you've done in the past, injuries, um, and we have a plethora of resources for yeah. you where we can help get you started and comfortable. Because the main key is something you can do long term, something you enjoy, and then from there we can help with a little bit yeah. of a push of something you might need um, to make it more effective for you as well too. Uh, so for, for those who may be newer to this, uh, what are maybe one or two things they can do today to, to kind of get on the right path? Yeah, so big one is planning. I mentioned before, you know, this is a really busy month, but yeah. What's my week look like? Where's the family at? Where are we traveling? What can I do even with equipment or without yeah. equipment? Um, because that's a big key too is maybe you're traveling and you're camping. You might not have equipment, but you can still do stuff with the family or go yeah. find things to do. So planning and then seek advice. Like we have 35 trainers on staff where we're extremely happy to just yeah. answer questions, get you started, just kind of get those resources out for individuals. Yeah, it, it can be intimidating if you've never really done it before, right? Mm -hmm. But like you mentioned, you can do it at home with or without equipment. You have just one dumbbell with you. Yep, yep. What can you do with one dumbbell that some anybody can do at home today? Yeah, so a lot of this can be uh, manipulated too with, you know, let's say you just have a bag, a duffel bag with books at home. Yeah. You can use any kind of equipment for you. Um, I brought one dumbbell today so we can look at some unilateral exercise. So yeah. some things you can do one-sided that's going to help prevent injury, uh, get you stronger, and it's also going to, you know, maybe help your golf game or help pickleball yeah. or, you know, some of those other activities you like to do as well, too. Um, so I brought my 20-pound dumbbell in today just to kind of show yeah, some of those for exercises sure. for you. Um, so very first one. So commonly we look at push-pull, squat, and hinge yeah. um, for your movement patterns. So really easy unilateral ones we can do. Instead of a two-legged squat, we can do a reverse lunge or just stepping Right. straight back okay. up and in but depending on our dominances it might be harder on one side than the other so that's kind of what we're trying to work yeah. on with that um, additionally we have our overhead press elbows forward pushing straight up overhead we're getting that compound aspect as well too where you know i'm using my core yeah. i'm using my shoulder i'm using a lot of muscle groups kind of like i'm reaching up into the cupboards trying to grab something yeah. for that too yeah and, and watching you do that i mean it really demonstrates just how easy you can do it at home yep. uh, just got to get started and do it right yes Absolutely. I mean, the key is seek advice if you're intimidated. Yeah. There, there's something for everybody and find something you like, find something you continue, can continue yeah. and just take those steps moving forward. It doesn't have yeah. to be revolutionary yeah. overnight. Very good advice there. Nick Fye, yeah. thank you for joining us today. Thank you so